stars descending on Disney's D23 Expo. Think Comic-Con for Disney fans, starting with Oprah and the girl power of A Wrinkle in Time. Look at this trifecta. How are you? How good? Look who's got the good line. Oh, let's Illuminating excitement as the insider witnessed the moment the queen of TV owned her place in Disney history. Be a warrior. I'll try. I've never been to anything like this. Breathtaking. It's big. It's bold. It's empowering. It's great. <laughs> Oprah was there to debut a Wrinkle in Time's trailer inside the D23 stage. Also there, director Ava DuVernay and co-stars Reese Witherspoon, Mindy Kaling, and Chris Pine. Imagine 91 billion light years traveled like that. Mighty fine Chris Pine looking mightier and finer in the trailer. Wow, it's a hell of an introduction. <laughs> Let me collect myself, hold on. And while Oprah may have magnificently transformed into a full blonde wise witch in the film out March 9, on stage she was 100% her authentic self. You told him you were going to give him a poster. <laughs> Everybody here get the poster! She did, she did the thing! It's just a poster, y'all, but okay. <laughs> The convention also featured a first glimpse at The Last Jedi's jaw-dropping stunts and poignant behind-the-scenes footage highlighting the legacy of the late Carrie Fisher. It's about family, and that's what's so powerful about it. She had already finished filming when her life was tragically cut short last December. I'm so mad she should be here. You know, I'll never stop missing her, and um, if she were here right now, she'd be off camera flipping me the bird. Hey, Mom. Hey, Dad. I'm doing that Star Wars stuff. Yeah, no big deal. On the carpet, John Boyega sweetly stayed connected to his family back home in the UK. Hi. Can everyone say hello to my mom and dad? Hi, mom. Hi, hi dad. Hey. <laughs> Tell us all the spoilers. <laughs> they don't know nothing. <laughs> what was it like to see all that footage? I mean, magical. Emily Blunt will proudly carry on Julie Andrews' legacy in the Mary Poppins sequel. No one is ever going to out Julie Julie Andrews. They're going to have to wait till Christmas 2018. Um, I was like, sorry, a little premature. And Josh Gad and Kristen Bell were also there to promote their sequel, Frozen 2. Frozen 2. Tell me the entire synopsis. It's really incredible. Um, Start opens with a funeral. There's some White of Walkers. A certain snowman. There's going to be. White Walkers come. A the undead. Dirt. It sounds remarkably similar to Game of Thrones. 